my dreams are, you know, sometimes of the past, sometimes of the future of having the life that I don't have now. I have a lot of good times that I wish could return. Those dreams I have on a daily basis. I also have nightmares, but the point is, dreams are the best part of my day. One second best. Sunrise is the first. Dreams are my second best. And I wish I could stay. So right now I live in a cave. It's a safe cave. It's an inner city cave. But in the city you need a place to keep your things and have them safe. Because unfortunately people in the city, even homeless people, steal from people who are homeless. The cave is a place where I can at least keep what little I have left mine. So I wake up early every day. I got a mere necessity and to leave myself from the cave. But I'm also a believer in the sunrise. I like to see the sunrise every day. And feel what kind of a day it's going to be by just how it feels. The things I look forward to mostly day to day now are to leave the cave, to find myself in a better environment so I can do better things. Because every day I do try to make a change in whatever form that I can to make it better than it was before. And even a small change, just a small level above where you were the day before always makes it better. The radio is a, a source of life for me because it's a crank radio. And if the batteries die, when they do that, die sometimes, I can provide my own energy to it. So, this is a must for weather, for anything else. A radio is for music. It's to have contact with a world who's kind of forgotten about you. You know, you can still have some kind of contact with it. So, it's a source of life. Wouldn't go anywhere without it. When I briefly went to Nashville, Tennessee, uh, I jumped a train headed back here. And I was with a friend who said he jumped trains all the time. And luckily enough, we made it down here by the grace of God or whatever. And I only knew that we were back it was when WWOZ came in on the radio. I said, oh, I know. We're back. We're cool. spiritual artist. I go on my feelings. I go on with a lot of symbolism. Symbols that are meant for a positive reason. Not for anything negative. Any symbol, of course, can be used for positive or negative, but I choose to see them in the light of positive. I like symbols and the eyes are important because they are truly the eyes, the mirror to the soul. And everyone expresses themselves differently. But they can't hide their eyes. They may have a shield of body, culture, and everything, but they can't hide. What's behind your eyes? The tools that I use as, as an artist now are mostly pen and ink, color pencils, markers. I would love to have acrylics, oils, canvas. But you know, if you don't have it, you make use of what you have. You know, and I find tools that you can use everywhere. Waste is a bad thing, and I make use of the waste, making it something useful. You know, I, I, I make sales. I mean, some days are very good, some days I don't sell a thing. But it just exposure of people seeing what I'm about and what I'm doing. It's good enough. I've had many good jobs in this city. From the House of Blues, to Tipitina's, to Marie Laveau's House of Voodoo, to Charter House Cafe. But finding jobs and having this kind of pay that you need to live in the city is not what it was. It's not keeping up with the cost of living in the city. You can get a, you can get a job in the city relatively easy, not necessarily full time, but as far as paying your rent, it's going to be difficult. Sometimes I get depressed like any other person. I think I could be clinically get depressed, but that's just the human nature of living. So, but I am basically hopeful that I can get this done and get it right to where it was before. Not to be wealthy and massively rich, but to be comfortable. Yeah, just have things that are normal and be happy, which is the hardest part. To be happy sometimes is the hardest part, but that too shall pass. I want people to see my artwork and see that spirit is not dead. Not religion, spirit is not dead. There's still spirit, there's good spirit and there's bad spirit, but good spirit is not dead.